quarantine. It's miserable. It, it's horrible. But you know what? We're all in this together. It's looking really serious. Like, everything has just been shut down. It don't look like no resort no more. I mean, like, so much for, like, have a soup. Guess we're just going to be looking at that bitch because we ain't about to touch no water for a long while. When they told me we have to be locked down for 14 days, I was kind of bummed about that. But I mean, you know, it is what it is. Luckily, I could go on my balcony and I could see everyone else. And the best thing about it is, if I don't like what they have to say, I can walk inside and close the door. Girls jump in when I want Guys, what are you doing? You gotta work out. No, you don't have to work out. You can get drunk like me. Amy, 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 you been drinking some wine, some champagne? Just two. 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 Hearing that the entire production is shut down, I feel like it's a good time to reflect. It's a good time to actually look over everything that's happened and actually see how serious the situations were. I mean, as far as the drama goes, there's a lot that happens in this house. So how's the wonderful vacation? It's gotta be great. I've been around somebody that's been exposed to COVID-19, so we are having to shut down and we are having to quarantine. Holy moly, damn. Yeah, <laughs> you know, we were having a good time and. Jeremiah's brother came to visit Josh, and it was like, you know, kind of rubbed all of us the wrong way, especially Gus, because, you know, him and Gus aren't always on the best of terms. They're leaving off with, like, what, what's going to happen? I think sometimes we allow the bad times to outweigh some of the good times that we've had. Y'all got to cut this out and, you know, get back to family. Y'all all one day going to be, you know, married, and they're going to see this. They're going to see the pictures where you're on vacation, asking who this is, who that is. And, mm -hmm. you know, if you want to be able to say, let's all of us get together. When we're going to go, you know, see Aunt Nelson, Amy, I mean, mm -hmm. I'm too short, son. I feel like with most vacations, we always air everything out. We say our last few words to one another. And usually everything, most everything gets resolved. And I feel like there is so many things that are still left unsaid and unspoken and unresolved. I get mad at myself for a lot of the actions that I have. And um, like, there's hiccups in the road. You're not always going to be perfect. But Amy pulled me aside and like told me that she can tell that I, I do have some good left in me. So that meant a lot hearing it from her. Because a lot of times I don't feel like people see that at all. I don't see Gus changing anytime soon. I don't see him accepting the fact that he has been an asshole this entire time and the fact that he needs to start changing his ways. You can't leave it like this. No family should leave what's going on like this. This has been by far the toughest vacation, but you know what? We're going to get through it and it's going to make us better. And I'm hoping that everybody's taking this time to kind of reflect on certain things. <laughs> where do we go from here, bro? Yeah, I don't know where we go from here. I don't know what we're going to do. I have no idea. <laughs> Thank you, dog. Appreciate you. Y'all be good. Love y'all. I don't like losing. So I am taking this contest so serious, like my life is depending on it. <laughs> <laughs>